Hi there, I'm Kelly Odeber, Realtor with the High Tide Group, and I'm here today with Sally Vance, a loan officer with Cross Country Mortgage. That's me. And we're here today to talk about um, some different options for buyers out there um, navigating this market with you know, some higher interest rates we've sold recently, but there's definitely still some great options for buyers out there. There are, absolutely. And Sally's very experienced. Mm -hmm. um, she's done some of my own loans before, um, so she's a fantastic resource and really knows her stuff. Well, thank you. Thanks for having me here, Kelly. Of course. Um, and it is a really crazy market right now. We're actually seeing rates in the mid sevens and even over eights on right. some of our clients with those lower credit scores, which is kind of nuts because I've done this 20 years. Yeah. Um, and when I came into the mortgage business, rates were about at seven and a half on a two year fixed arm, which was an adjustable rate mortgage. Yeah. So I feel right now this market is kind of like right before when I came in, because I think we're headed into a recession and um, everyone out there probably experienced some of those really great interest rates that right. we've had over the last few years. Right. Those are gone. Right. And um, unfortunately, humans are creatures of habit. So what happens in a recession is people are gonna use those credit cards that they paid off and they're gonna get into debt and have to refinance those rates. God. So we're having to look for ways to combat the rates that are increasing. Right. And you have some different um, loan products that you've been we using do. recently um, that are really you know, great options for buyers out there. We do. It's crazy because I feel like it's become full circle in the market. And um, I've always told my team that the last three years have been, we didn't have to really work. I mean, our phones just rang. We were just taking orders basically, you know, and now we actually have to work and do mortgages <laughs> again. Um, which is cool for me because I've done this 20 years. So I get to do loans I haven't done in years, such as first and seconds, meaning a first loan with a second behind it to kind of get someone a better rate at maybe a 30% or 25% down conventional with a HELOC behind it. Right. You know, that would get them a more affordable mortgage. Or a 2-1 buy down, which right. we can talk about in a minute, yeah. which can get someone a rate right now in the fours or fives versus the sevens really helping our clients to get more affordable payments and bank statement loans and things like this are coming back out of the woodworks that a lot of people haven't seen in a long time. Yeah, I think that it is a good time for buyers right now in the market, you know, it regardless is. of you know, where we started in the year with rates and where we are now. Um, I think that, um, you know, we, there's definitely some options for them to still be able to get into the home that they're mm -hmm. looking for um, and maybe refinance later. Absolutely. Yeah. And I mean, you know, even though rates are high right now, the reality is if you're paying rent, right. you're paying 100% interest. You're paying someone else's mortgage. Absolutely. You know, so, um, and the reality is if you guys Google this, the national average expected appreciation across the country next year will be 10.8%. Florida, we can obviously expect it's going to be a lot more. Right. I think um, we've had over 30% in the last two years increase, which we won't see anything like that again. Mm -hmm. But even if you assume a 10%, if you purchase a $500,000 home, mm -hmm. let's say that you do a 5% down payment, which is allowed conventional, assume about 5% for closing costs, total uh, investment $50,000 on that $500,000 home. Assuming a 10% appreciation, what is that house going to be worth next year? 550, right? Yeah. So that money is 100% return on that investment, that ROI. So when clients ask me, is this still a good time to buy? Yes, it right. is. So you refinance your rate next year. The first year you only pay interest anyways. Right. At least you're building that equity. Yeah. Good you place. Know? So real estate's still a great place to you exactly. your money at. Yeah. Exactly. It is a guarantee that it's going to increase. We know that for sure. Yeah. And in every recession over time, except in 08, because that was a little different. But in every recession over time, real estate has increased, except for 08. And again, that happened because of stated loans and basically, uh, correct. There, yeah. That will never happen again. Yeah. <laughs> and that's why loans are so hard right now, because of what happened in 08. Right. That's a really good point. Mm -hmm. um, so you have the buy down as an we option do. with buyers. We do. Um, what are some other programs that you're seeing? So the buy down, just to sort of explain that a little bit, um, it's not what people think, it's not buying points. So we can buy points too, and there's definitely that option. But this buy down actually does have to be paid by the seller. So it's something that does need to be negotiated in your contract. Okay. Um, and essentially, we lock the client at an actual 7.5%, and 
what rate they would qualify for. But the 2-1 buy-down allows that the seller prepays the interest so that the first year, that rate is five and a half, and the second year it's six and a half. Okay. On a $500,000 loan, this is probably gonna save them over $600 a month that first year. That's a lot. It's a lot. Yeah. And it keeps the home affordable. Next year, we expect rates to be back in the force. This is all political right now. It's all inflation related. Um, and we do expect rates in the next year, maybe a little bit longer, but next year we do expect them back in the force. We can refinance you, get you back into that affordable mortgage, and you're still cash in that equity. So that's a good option to, you know, get you into a house now, especially Correct. where we're seeing, exactly. um, you know, list prices sell less, um, you know, exactly. buyers have more option for negotiation now, but then still have that ability to, you know, rates go down next year. To refinance. refinance and um, exactly. still got you in the house. So. Exactly. Yeah. Or even, I see a lot of clients that just aren't finding exactly what they want. Right. But so you get this first home, and then next year you sell and look at that equity you've got. This yeah. huge down payment, you're still not paying rent. So the reality is, if you can buy right now, you should be buying. Right. I, I agree. I think it is a good time for buyers in this market right now. It's a really good point. Yeah. Um, awesome. So, so um, some other things, like you, I know you'd asked before. Um, Right now, we've obviously here in this area been affected recently by a hurricane. Right. And a lot of people don't realize that FHA actually offers what's called a 203H. It's a disaster program. Interesting, yeah. So if you actually have any renters or owners, it really honestly I feel works best for the renters because for an owner it just sort of becomes a 203K, which is a renovation loan. So if you own your home and it has been destroyed, we can help you with that on a renovation loan to do those repairs and renovations. Okay, um, interesting. Otherwise, if you are renting, it's super amazing. FHA will allow 100% financing wow. if you're um, if you were displaced by a natural disaster. Wow, that's really good to know. That's great because I've been seeing all over Facebook and all over the community how many renters are being basically, you know, displaced with no place to go. Right. And most people who are renting haven't saved up that down payment, and that usually is what is hindering them yes. from purchasing. Yeah. So it's normal FHA qualifications. Okay. So um, down to basically, I would say a 620 credit score, probably they could do 100%. Um, if they're lower than that, it's still doable, but they're probably going to need down payment or some credit help, okay. which we can also coach them on. Perfect. Yeah, Sally, one great thing about working with Sally um, at Cross Country is that she uh, does Zoom videos with you, so she's really good at breaking things down and you know educating um, her clients on um, the different products that she offers. So Yeah, thank you. I've been doing this a long time, so um, I'm looking for lifelong clients, and we like to educate our clients not only just on mortgages, but how they can you know master their take-home pay. I love talking about ROI um, with clients and how Eventually, that house can be a reverse mortgage. It can actually pay for itself, and you can live with no mortgage payments once you're over the age of 62. So I actually talk to every client, starting from first-time home buyers, about structuring that retirement plan to include that mortgage to end up paying for itself so that you can actually live off that retirement that you've earned. Wow. Well, yeah, so you've got some really great options in helping people build you know, generational wealth through, through real estate. Absolutely. It is. It is the very best thing, and I do a wealth will. I would love to maybe do that one time or another with you, but the very first thing in that wealth will is buy a primary residence. It's the number one best way you can be investing your money. There's nothing better in the surf. Number two, make sure you're investing in your 401k. Max it out. <laughs> awesome. All right. Well, those sound like some great options um, for buyers out here in the market. Um, we'd love to be able to help you know work together to achieve those goals and um, yeah, anything else you want to um, I have a great video that I did for the 2-1 buy down so okay. if anybody out there listening is interested we can always send that to you just shoot us a, a you know a message on this link or an email and uh, we'll send it out to you so you guys can see how that 2-1 buy down works um, and how it can really allow you to still buy right now and afford it and then you know still capture that equity awesome. and be a homeowner Yes, great. Well, we're both resources. We'd love to be able to help you and assist you in um, making your goals a reality. Thanks so much for having me. Yeah, thank you. Bye, guys.